In a world where we're surrounded by chemicals in our everyday lives, harnessing the power of something all natural has never been stronger. So today we're exploring the clinical studies and benefits of medicinal mushrooms and their role in promoting holistic wellness. I headed out to Nature's Outlet to learn more. Mushrooms really capture the imagination of us. We have to think that mushrooms didn't really even have their own kingdom until 1969 and we know that they're in the kingdom of fungi and fungi grow in these amazing beautiful formations when we're walking in the forest and seeing them growing here and there and it just really captures the imagination. They're very different than plants, they're very different than animals. We really are still finding out a lot about them as, as the science of, of uh, studying mushrooms where mycology progresses. They're very different, but they're also very like us, right? They're actually more like animals than they are like plants. We share 55% of our own DNA with the fungal kingdom that mushrooms belong to. We share only around 15% with plants, to put that in perspective. And we have a lot of similarities. Uh, animals or humans inhale oxygen, exhale carbon dioxide, mushrooms do the same. And you compare that to plants, plants actually inhale carbon dioxide and exhale oxygen, thankfully, for us and for the mushrooms. And some of mushrooms have the ability to make vitamin D from sunlight, just like we do. In fact, some mushrooms have melanin, uh, the same substance that gives our complexion the, its tone. Uh, mushrooms have this. So there are uh, quite a few more similarities between animals and mushrooms and animals and plants. So let's talk more about the idea of why get your mushrooms, not only from eating them, but from supplementation because a raw mushroom is really not gonna do you a lot of good, is it? No, absolutely not. And you know, I think some people that feel like they don't like mushrooms or they don't like the taste of mushrooms, maybe they've only tried like that, um, mushroom, that raw mushroom at the salad bar, on their salad, or maybe on their pizza. And we've got to think there are multiple different types of edible mushrooms out there. Um, but the, the way to absorb the good nutrients from mushrooms is you've got to cook them. You've got to cook them thoroughly. All mushrooms have very tough cell walls. Uh, they're not like plants, they're different. And so we, humans did not develop the enzymes to be able to break down that mushroom cell wall. And I think some people have even maybe gotten a stomach ache from eating raw mushrooms before. And that's because we were just not designed to break down raw mushroom material. All mushrooms that you eat need to be cooked thoroughly and all mushrooms that you take in a supplemental form need to be prepared correctly for them to be bioavailable to the human digestive tract. And you need the good parts of the mushroom, like the mycelium, in the supplement form to really give you that two-punch, right? Absolutely. Mushroom mycelium has really had a renaissance. More people know what it is now. Mycelium is the part of the mushroom that's buried in the wood it's growing on or in the leaf litter. And it's where all of the executive function of the organism is taking place. Mushroom mycelium is the mushroom's immune system. It is the mushroom's digestive system. It's where the mushroom makes very novel antioxidant compounds to keep it alive and healthy. And this is the part of the mushroom that we have really pioneered in the supplement world, we being host defense, because we recognize that mushroom mycelium has everything that's in the fruiting body, but it also generates so many additional compounds that are beneficial for human health and longevity. And there's a lot of scientific studies that back this up, right? Absolutely. In fact, most of the modern research is focusing on mycelial science right now. Um, and that's true for many different species that are now being looked at very closely for their potential help with neurological functioning and cardiovascular support and uh, oxygenation. And we're gonna talk about some of those today specifically. But the evidence, the scientific evidence on using and harnessing the power of mushrooms through mushroom mycelium is really growing exponentially. And we're gonna, like you said, talk more specifically about the different types of mushrooms. 
and, and how you can find them out here at Nature's Outlet. And speaking of which, we are at Nature's Outlet and host defense is kind of like the cream of the crop when it comes to products that completely study mushrooms, right? We're founded by a mycologist, Dr. Paul Stamets. He has over 40 years of experience in not just making mushroom supplements, he actually teaches other mycologists. He has taught people how to grow uh, through solid state fermentation. That's how we grow our mushrooms uh, for many decades now. And he founded Host Defense to generate revenue to put back into mushroom research. It is a passion of all of us that work there to continue this research into all the benefits that you can obtain from mushroom mycelium. And we'll be learning more about the different types of mushrooms and segments in the future. And you can learn more about host defense mushroom products out at a nature's outlet near you. They have locations in Forest, Roanoke, Martinsville, and Salem. For more information, give them a call at 434-215-3102 Find them on social media or head online to naturesoutlet.net.